Don't wanna talk anymore. Nothing left to say. Words make no sense anyway. When we're at war, something's never changed. It never hurts the same. You take the color from my eyes. I watch it fade like a dying. A different fight Cause it almost feels like Someone else is living my life Tristan. Yes, I was able to track down your phone number. It's not hard. I mm, has me no. some, I have some information. I'm in Domino City right now, actually. Why are you over in Domino? I came to the car shop in Domino. It just was better for It was just better. The card shop that was in Paris was kind of low quality. The one in Domino's way better, but that's beside the point. Um I mean does it really matter I, when you can't see any cards? Mm -hmm. yeah, well, I could scan the cards to figure out what they are, so and then holographically project images onto the blank cards. But that's beside the point of... I've gathered some information. I don't know be. how useful this information will be. I have a feeling that Ryan checked into the hospital of Paris under an alias. What? Because I contacted somebody... And the dragon and three dragon lords were defeated, apparently. Uh, so Void was able to beat Art and the Rainbow Winged Duelist, who I don't remember his name, but I know he's a dragon lord because he has Tamias. No idea who that is. Well, I have no idea either, but he was able to defeat both of them. That is so, worrisome, to say the least. That should be since Art bodied three of us by himself, but yes. Uh, my informant has said that there was somebody that checked in in the hospital, and this person wasn't entered in the tournament originally. And I'm sorry, but the name that was registered into the hospital was Tiger. Wait, what? Yes, Are the retired XK King of Games. What? The retired King of Games. You think that someone that has entered the hospital? The ex key of games, that would be all over the media. Especially since he was never in the tournament to begin with. So I have a feeling Ryan booked into the hospital under an alias because he doesn't know that I faked his death. So I, we should meet back up at the helicopter. Alright. And we will track down the hospital he's in. And we will figure if Ridley Tiger's there, well then, cool. Then that's a way. Then we waste our time. But if it's not, and it's Ryan, then we have a. Lead. I mean, the Tiger Series could help, but. True. So we should probably go from there. Either way, we should go. I'm heading over there as fast as I can. I will book. Actually, I don't even have to book a plane. I have a jet waiting for me to bring me back to Paris. So I'll be there in about an hour. All right. See you then. Well, that was a short flight. It should be. Yeah, huh? Uh, so you're finally oh. here. Shouldn't you have been here like way before me? I had to fly from Domino back here. I was on the little other side of town and I had to run. Why run? Why don't you just get a taxi? Did you forget nobody's basically here? Most of them, everyone has left town. 
You can still get a cab! Or a motorbike! Or something! Also, I'm sad. The house is still here and my uh, bar is not open yet. Oh well. That's not the point. I thought that was gonna be- Get it's raining! Damn! Even the weather hates this today. Alright, let's get in the house. Or, it could be a spontaneous... Storm! Okay. Europe makes no sense whatsoever. That does not. Domino. See. Domino had way much, way better weather. So, we have to go to the Hospital of Paris. And not the hospital Matt is at, apparently. The, another, there's another hospital. So that's where we have to head. I've locked the GPS coordinates into the phone. So we will head there right. and see if it's actually, and see if it's actually Tiger or not. I guess. Well, what are we waiting for? Let's go. Uh, we still can't take the helicopter. Why? Because I still never had anyone fuel it. <laughs> We're gonna have to take either motorbikes, cars, limos, any other form of travel. <sighs> Charter planes. <laughs> or at least you get a charter plane. Also, you didn't say anything about my snazzy new outfit either, but I think it's fine. I mean, I mean... It was probably about time for a change, I guess. Since you kind of killed, it, killed us off yeah. officially. Yep. But, alright. We will head there. We'll have to grab an Uber, I guess, or something. There's no one in town anymore! Ubers can come into town. That, that's the whole point of it being an Uber. <sighs> hey, I like the new look. Thanks. I need a haircut anyway. So, how's the deck? Much better now. Flows smoother. Works around Destiny board. And I have a few extra deck monsters in there too. Wait a second. Changing from red eyes to fiends, are we, mm -hmm. Tiger? You change your look too. Well, where did you get an anti-millennium fang? It's almost like you're not actually Tiger at all. Registrating under under a name after I faked your death. Really, Ryan? Wait, you faked my death? Wait, hold on. Tristan, wait, Tristan! Wait, wait, wait how? Psycho, you son of a- Well, Psycho, why are you here? And you better mm. make it good. Well, I was in the neighborhood, and I saw this guy in the river. So naturally, I lent a hand like any decent person would. <laughs> Don't bother making no excuses. There's not kind bone in your entire body. I, I thought your brother wasn't nice. He's just acting. Okay, hold on. What's on here? How? I don't know what's happened between you two, but your brother? He's been really nice to me. He saved my life. Oh, he's just taking credit, because I can't see him being nice without something in it for him. Okay, Hal, that's not- I literally have the scars to prove it, Psycho! But Hal, I- Shut it! <clears throat> Ryan, what the hell is on your arm? Also... Wait a minute. Hal? What? What's going on? I don't know what happened between you two, but your brother is sort of. Look, seems nice. I mean, he's only acting. Dude, I'm not acting. Well, beside the point, uh, uh, Ryan, what's on your arm? What is this thing? Dual disc. Yeah, oh, it looks like. Me. Mine, mine was destroyed by a kaiju user, so Psycho, that means I'll one. It Pretty much. I'm, I'm assuming that means void, right? Uh. Yeah. Uh, well wait. then, I guess Welcome it's a good to the club, thing. Then, Ryan. I guess it's a good thing I made this for you. What is that? Why does it look like a disco light? <laughs> it is your new dual disc. I literally based it on when you had your armor equipped. It. Only seeing it a few times, I was able to redesign it and rebuild it so color is just a bit off but though your armor you have like... to admit his I armor mean... looked like a big disco light what did you want 
It, it's very does, bright. It does kind of look like a disco light. It really well, does. It, yeah, you haven't seen him in his damn armor. His armor's a giant disco light. My armor doesn't exist anymore. Uh. Well then. The, That's a problem. Now isn't it? Voids, kaijus, took the spirits of all my blue eyes cards and Critias, and my armor along with it. Hmm. Well, we will have to figure that out, but that. Hmm. I might be disco light, but at least it's not falling apart. True. Also, it has the new VR technology in it and the new dueling system. Where the new Whoa. one now? Uh, based on Kaiba's technology, that's not ready for release yet. He's made a kind of program, if you would. Yes, it's it, well. I use virtual cards in a virtual oh, environment. Did you say you faked my death? I faked everyone's death. Hold wait, up! Wait, it, so wait. my dueling record was wiped clean. Uh, yeah. Hold up! So oh. do I need to restart the whole tournament? Just in oh. your leg. Do you still have all the cards in your possession? No, no, the boss cards? No, 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 no. Do I need to start the whole tournament? You have the, the boss cards, don't you? Episodes. Over two years of content. What? I mean, you, you mean... Uh, you dude, are you sure the hospital discharged you? What are you even talking about? Never mind, never mind, never mind. Answer the question! You have if you the have boss, the boss cards. cards, if you have the boss cards, then that proves your victory. So no, you do not need to restart. You're uh, good. Yeah, I've still got all all five cards. Five. One, two, three, four. I only have four. Would we... you fight? I didn't fight. <laughs> um, I have. Let me see here. I've got. Because yeah, last person we fought was that a chef. Game. I've got Wait. the Ancient Gear Golem, the Insect yeah. Queen, Ventred Revolution, yeah, Madonchi yeah. Croissant, and yes. Despian Quatris. The what? The last Despian one I don't know! Where did you fight him? In the Shadow Realm. What's that fair? Wait, 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 Shadow Realm? Don't worry about it. Uh, okay. These g- <laughs> Y y y mm, that's not fair. How do we fight someone that did another realm? Well, uh, the original thing, he's in a giant spooky ass mansion. About three miles that way. Um, you know what? We'll figure that out. You know what? Do you even have a working deck right now? Yeah, actually. Uh, can I just have my deck back, please? Oh, yeah. Here you go, man. You uh, tested him with your deck? Yeah. Well, yeah, I kind of helped him upgrade his deck. It was the deck he used in Battle City, and let's just say, couldn't do jack shit the way it was before. Language. Sorry. Well, I, I was going to say, uh, well, Bruise in the database, I happen to find a deck that perfectly fits you and your style, especially with your new look. It's called, keep on my new look? it's called Magic Keys, and it's maybe based on a oh, franchise what? you know. <gasps> Is it? So, is it? Yes, it's based is on it? that series. So it definitely fits your style. Well, you might need to try that out. It should be in your dual disc. It's in your dual disc. I when told you. you. Walk away. Ah no! Please hey, stop now. We do not want that. I'm guessing he really likes that archetype, doesn't he? Stop it. He doesn't even know what the archetype is. It's just based on something he likes. That he's a hardcore fan of. Wow. Well, that's just not the point. It's in your dual disc, in the program. You can use it and try it. Speak well, I'm surprised yeah. you haven't asked him for his deck yet. Very true. Brian, give me your deck. I already told you they're gone. Give uh, me your deck. What don't you understand about it's gone? I will scan it. The cards are blank. The scanner still seems to work on the blank cards. I oh, could go, I could go into the details, but it would go over your head on how it works. Oh wait, 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 wait a minute! Don't, don't the cards have the serial number? When the cards are blank, they still, they still retain the digital fingerprint, the code 
of the card still exists. Now, you can you cannot use it because the code was registered to you, which is now blank. So you cannot use it. But if I scan your deck, I can use it. I don't want to use my cards. Uh... You can I tried using Hal's deck and I absolutely. I, I, I tried to use Hal's deck and it's absolutely. And I, and I can't use it whatsoever. You tried I need using my doll actually... deck. You didn't try using my sabers, if I remember correctly. Yes, uh, I tried using your other deck and it was. And I barely was able to win against the chef that now I own. Right. I still have my deck, but the prettiest card has actually gone. Like, it, it vanished. I it couldn't it. use it anyways. The the gods and the and the drag, legendary dragons aren't. They're in the database, but they don't work. So it's not like it would matter anyways. Okay, le okay. legendary wait, dragons. Thank you. Do <sighs> Give me a second to scan that, and there. It's now I can shenanigans. Use Don't get involved. Um, I'm kind of oh. involved whether you like it or not. Uh, Brother brothers can quarrel. Brothers can quarrel. Let the duel it out. Duel it out. Just duel it out. Listen. You, Tristan, shush. Look, I am sick and tired of you being a bad mood just because of you walling around in the past. I'm sick and tired of it. How you really fight. think it's easy to forget? Several years worth of torment! Just like that! Oh, shut up! Dude, do it I now. said I was sorry! Tristan, do you want to go and play test this new deck? Yeah, let's go play test. Okay, <laughs> okay, you know what? I am sick and tired of you bringing up the past just to just to just to try and stab at me, you know what? We're dueling right here and right now. This is the only way to get through your thick head that I've changed over the stupid shit that happened. <laughs> so, you know what? Let's duel right now. Fine, let's duel. Let's duel. <laughs> All right, let's see who goes first. And it looks like I have to choose. You can go first. Fine. Well, in that case, let me start off by summoning Samurai Skull. Samurai Skull? This will let me bury a zombie from my deck straight into my graveyard. Uh... Where's your element savers? I've never seen you use zombies. I don't think I did it my spectral sword for now. Uh... Again, where are your element savers? They're your favorite. The kaijus happen if it isn't obvious. I'll end my turn. Giant monsters? Okay then. Well, I guess we'll figure that out later. It's my turn. I'll place one card face down and activate the spell, Card of the Red Stone. I'll send a level 7 red eyes from my hand to the grave to draw two cards. Then I can send a level 7 red eyes from my deck to the graveyard. And I'm going to send this card, the Red Eye Soul. Then I activate the spell Red Eyes Fusion. This allows me to fusion summon a Red Eyes monster from my deck or extra deck by using monsters from my hand and deck. So, I'm going to be fusing together the Red Eyes Black Dragon in my deck and the Meteor Impact in my deck to bring out Meteor Black Comet Dragon. Now I activate Comet Dragon's effect. Now, I'll send this Darkness Metal to the grave to do you 1400 points of damage. Then I activate the spell Red Eyes Insight. This will allow me to send hmm, Red Eyes Wyvern to the graveyard. When I do that, I'm allowed to get a Red Eyes spell or trap, and I'll bring the Red Eyes Spirit to my hand. Now, I'll set one card face down on the field, and then I'm gonna go to my battle phase. Now, Meteor Black, attack with Meteor Blast! Not enough! Scrap Iron Scarecrow, negate the attack! Ah, darn it. Hate that trap. Alright, it's your move. I'll draw. And you know what? It would be a good move. Hmm. So many things I could do. 
Really? So now I think I'll start off by summoning my Uni Zombie. Alright. Let's have my Tengu, the winged Mayakashi, take flight! Uh, um, okay, um, well, I don't really like that monster, so I'm going to activate Lost Wind. Now I can select one special summon monster on the field, and negate its special abilities, and make it lose half its attack points. Very well. I'll set two cards face down and activate the effect of Shunui Spectre Sword in my graveyard by bashing it with my little friend here. I can Synchro Sun straight from my graveyard. So let me introduce you to Samurai Saga. All right, the Lost Winds effect activates since you special summoned, and then I'll also follow that up by activating the trap Red Eye Spirit. Now I can bring back a monster from my grave, and I'll bring back my red eye soul. Hmm. Always too hasty to waste all your resources, aren't you? Who says I'm wasting? Well, first off, Mystical Space Typhoon shall destroy your lost wind. Hmm. Alright. Fine. Next on my Semi Saga, take out your red eye soul! Fine, but not before Red Eye Soul takes away a lot of your life points. You take damage equal to Meteor Black's attack points. <sighs> and now that you destroyed my dragon, I can activate the effect of Keeper of the Shrine and summon it to the field. A bit of an annoyance, but I'll end my turn. Alright, it's my turn. And I think I have a good play to do here. I'll start things off by summoning Gear Freed, the Red Eyes Iron Knight, and then I'll equip my my knight with Meat Black Metal Dragon. And now I activate the effect of Red Eyes Iron Knight. Since I equipped it with something, I could destroy the equip card and then destroy a spell or trap on the field. And I'm getting rid of that scrap iron. And now Black Metal Dragon's effect activates from the graveyard. When I do that, I'm then allowed to get a Red Eyes card. From my deck. And I think I'll bring. Hmm, how about the Red Eyes Black Dragon? And now, I think I'm going to overlay both of my my monsters to bring out the Tornado Dragon. Now I'll activate Tornado Dragon's ability. So by using one overlay unit, I can destroy a spell or trap on the field. I'm getting rid of that one on the far right. Call the Haunted. Nice. Alright, now, Meteor Black, wipe out a Samurai Saga. Won't be happening, I'm afraid. You, like I said, you tend to rush to things a bit too quickly. Perfect for Ghost of a Grudge. Since you have all more monsters in your cards in your grave, all monsters you control lose all the attack points permanently. Well, fine. My Meteor Black has a special ability anyway, which means I can bring back one normal monster from my graveyard. And I'm going to bring back my Black Flare Dragon. And I also get to bring back my Keeper of the Shrine. Due to that Tengu's effect, I'm not going to battle it. That was very clever of you using that card. Well, I'll start by switching my Tengu to defense mode. And then I think I'll still must summon the Shirinui Squire. What is that card? Well, when she is normal summon, I can special summon a Spectre Sword straight from my hand or deck. Oh, that's not good. So I think I summon a Spectre Sword Shade.
And by using my Shades effect, I can tribute him to bring back two banished monsters back into play. Oh dear. So I could use these two for an effect. Now let's see, since I have so many options at my disposal. What to choose, what to choose. You know what? I don't think I'll use my special sword with my squire to get for a second Samurai Saga. And now let's start by taking care of that tornado dragon. And then let's slot on your red eyes black flare before you can Gemini summon it. Ah, uh, great. Now in my turn. Yeah. Alright. I'll place one monster face down in defense mode. And then I'll lay this card face down. It's your move. I'll draw for turn. And I think I'll start off by normal summoning Shunui Samurai to the field. Using Samurai's effect, I can banish my Squire to gain attack power. And since Sa Squire was banished, I get to draw a card, but I have to discard a card. So I think I'll throw away my Swordmaster for later. Samurai so Saga attacked the face down. You attacked my Mass Dragon. And when Mass Dragon is destroyed, I get to bring back another monster. Hmm. As long as that's 1500 or less attack. Let me guess another Mass Dragon. Hmm. Maybe. Or maybe it's something completely different. Hmm. Guess I don't have any cho choice here. I'm gonna bring out this in defense mode. The Strudo! Hmm. Well, let's get rid of that Keeper of the Shrine, shall we? It's not in my turn. I'll lay one more card face down and end my turn. And because I didn't normal summon, I'm allowed to bring out a red eyes card from my graveyard. Mm -hmm. I'll bring out this, my red eyes darkness metal dragon. Fair enough. With that being the case, I think I'll just switch all my monsters to defense mode and end my turn. Right? It's my turn. And I activate Red Eyes Darkness Metal Dragon's special ability. Now, once every turn, I can bring back one dragon from the grave or summon a dragon from my hand. And I think I might have just the card I need. I hope, anyway. I'm going to summon to the field my black metal dragon. And now, I tune together my Destrudo with my black metal dragon to play Hot Red Dragon Archfiend. Now black metal dragon's effect activates. Meaning I can now grab one red ice card. And I'm going to bring the Red Eyes Alternative Black Dragon in my hand. Next, I'll set one card. And then... I'm going to activate the effect Alternative Black. By sending Red Eyes to the grave, I can summon it to the field. 
And with that, I end my turn. Really now? Probably have an effect that can go off, so I'm taking my time and wait. In that case, let me switch these three back into attack mode for you. Didn't mean to activate that, but that doesn't matter too much. In fact, I think I'll banish my Swordmaster. Allow me to give my Semi Saga a power boost to the end of the turn. Next, I'll set my Samurai to attack mode. And have my Samurai attack your alternative black. And now to get rid of that problematic hot red dragon Archfiend! Keeper of the Shrine has an effect. I could come back. That it can. That it can. But now that I have an open zone, I can then with some of my Solitaire. Using Solitaire's effect and tributing itself, I can special summon a zombie tuner that has zero defense for my deck. Such as my Spectral Sword. And using my Spectral Sword with my Samurai Saga, say hello to Shogun Saga. Wow. It's quite the attack point. I think I won't be using his effect, though. And with that, I'll think I'll end my turn. Alright. Well. This is gonna cost me a... Cost me a chunk of my life points, but... Don't have much of a choice here. Yeah. I'm gonna set one card face down and activate their Strudo special ability. It's going to cost me half my life points, but I could summon it straight back to the field from the grave. Only it's leveled. Level becomes three. Now I'll use the Strudo and Keeper of the Shrine in order to play Exploder Dragon Wing. Now I have to play Darkness Metal special ability, which means I could bring back one dragon from the grave or so from the field. And, I think I have just the one in mind. Come back to the field, Black Flare Dragon! Now I Gemini summon Black Flare Dragon! If this move works, Hal, I'm afraid this duel's over. Now Exploder Dragon Wing! Attack with Exploder Dragon Flare! Now I activate the ability of Exploder Dragon Wing. Instead of doing you damage, it destroys your monster and it's... Then you take damage equal to the attack points it had. Now, Red Eyes, Black Flare Dragon, Black Flare Strike! And now, I activate Black Flare Dragon's effect, wiping out the rest of your life points. It's over. Well, looks like I win. Like that's any surprise. Now do you see that I've changed? Do you really think a duel decides anything? Well, yeah, a duel can tell a lot about a person. You know that. But a person can lie to themselves and to others. Dude, I told you. I've done with all that. I'm leaving that part of myself behind. I'm trying to make a fresh start. And you think people can change that easily? That they can just shift who they are on the whim? Listen to me, bro. I really am sorry for what I did. And if I could take back what I did, I would. In a heartbeat. But look, look. This stuff between you and me, it no longer matters now. What matters now is stopping father. That's the most important thing right now. Do you really think that even if you did change, that the two of us alone could beat Father? Well, I mean... Do you we really have... think that a man who has toppled entire criminal organizations, the man who stands atop of all of America's criminal underworld, 
and is now spreading his reach beyond is someone that just two kids can take on. Are you really that naive? Maybe I am naive. Or maybe... Just maybe I have a different perspective on things. Kind of hard for me to have multiple perspectives with only one eye. And considering Look. what that one other eye saw for the last time. Listen, how this beef between you and me does not matter. What matters is what's happening right now with your little buddies outside and the whole giant monster situation. That's what you'll be focusing on. Not the drama that you and I have been through in our childhood throughout this entire time. None of that matters. Considering the people responsible for this have connections to Father, I would say otherwise. For all I know, you hear the backs of us when our backs are turned. Listen to me. I told you, I'm no longer aligned with Father or the Lockhart family. Okay, I'm on my own just like you, alright? Look, if you want to continue being mad at me, fine, but you're gonna have to let this go eventually, alright? And actually try, and try and let yourself heal from it, alright? Heal? Like there's anything left to heal. I'm already far too broken for that. You just have to look at me to see the, even just a fraction of the damage. I told you I was sorry, Hal. I really am sorry. Fine. <laughs> this doesn't change a thing, but... I know right when we'll hear the end of it from Ryan if I just... keep this going, at least while we're having to deal with this mess. So, can we actually put aside our differences and work together? I'll do my best to keep the bile down. Thank you. Remember, this changes nothing. <laughs>